Time an off duty officer hailed a hero tonight after he jumped into action to help take down a suspect. The officer was even stabbed during the scuffle. Eyewitness News reporter Shante Lands explains what happened today in Bucks County. The off duty Lansdale police officer is 36 year old Daniel Gallagher. He's a nine year veteran, and today he was stabbed in his shoulder while trying to help other officers make an arrest. All I heard from the back room was a siren go past me from the parking lot out back. Employees and customers at giant grocery store Wawa and CVS along Route 309 in Quakertown in Bucks County say they saw police chasing a man later identified as 45 year old Stephen Diedelhauser of Soderton. During the pursuit, the Bucks County District Attorney says Diedelhauser used a knife to stab an off duty Lansdale police officer. 36 year old Daniel Gallagher in his left shoulder. The DA says it all started with disturbance calls to police after Diedelhauser allegedly showed a knife and pulled a fire alarm at multiple businesses. He ended up at CBS, where authorities say he was tackled in the parking lot. Officer Gallagher, who was off duty, jumped into action and tackled the suspect to the ground. At an afternoon press conference, Lansdale Police Chief called Officer Gallagher a hero. I'm very proud of him. I, I, I would have expected nothing less. His, uh, his actions are a shining example to the professionalism, professionalism of his, this agency and, and law enforcement in general. Similar sentiments shared by District Attorney Matt Weintraub. He was off duty today, but when he saw the call to act, he didn't, he didn't stop to put on his uniform. He didn't check to see if he had his bulletproof vest. He didn't check to see if he had his service weapon. He didn't stop for any of those things. His first in instincts were not for his own safety and protection, but for that of his fellow officers and for members of the public. Officer Gallagher was rushed to St. Luke's Hospital. He's been since released. He's at home resting with his wife and children. Meanwhile, that suspect faces several charges like aggravated assault against officers as well as terroristic threats. In Bucks County, in Doylestown, Shante Lands, CBS 3 Eyewitness News.